Hey guys, RC here, back with Football Manager 20 episode, what is this, episode 5? I think it's 5, 5 sounds right. It's been a few days, let's go with 5. Uh, so we are playing today, but I wanted to come back uh, for this email. Jack Atchison uh, finished 2nd in the League uh, 2 Young Player of the Month for November, so that is good. He also had a goal of the month. Uh, he had two really solid goals in this game. We'll look at the uh, scores and results here in just a minute. But uh, he had a he had a 30 yard goal and a 27 yard goal, almost from the same spot. Uh, really, really good finishes. And I finished second in the head coach of the month accolades. So let's go ahead and get up to the game time. Uh, we are hemorrhaging money. So we were almost a million dollars just a few months ago, and now we're barely breaking even. We have lost money this month pretty severely, and that is because I like to spend money, just like in real life. Uh -huh. uh, my wife agrees. Um, she's still not over the fact that I spent money on the computer instead of just getting one of equal value. Uh, so... But we are spending half a million dollars per year less than allowed. So I have a half a million dollars more I could spend, but I'm not going to. All right, so fitness test. So let's take a look at the schedule here real quick after we left off uh, after the Ipswich game. We beat Plymouth, one, or we drew 1-1 one, one with Plymouth. Uh, Lloyd James with an 86-minute equalizer for us to salvage a point. And then a solid 3-1 win over Leighton Orient. Uh, Atchison with the aforementioned brace uh, in a five-minute span. And Aaron Collins added one late for the 3-1 victory. Currently, that has us sitting in fifth position. Seven wins, nine draws, three defeats, a plus-seven goal differential, and 30 points. So we are right in the heart of this playoff group. But only three points off third position for, I guess, I'm assuming, automatic promotion and eight points behind Plymouth and Crewe. Uh, didn't we... Now, the, the game against Crewe today is the FA Cup. We just drew with them recently at home. So we are playing away today. So let's get to it. Uh, we are underdogs, but they're inconsistent. We're in excellent form. So I am going to... But I'm going to... I've been playing this tactic at home or as a favorite, and I've been playing this tactic uh, when we are uh, underdogs. So I think we're going to go with this one. You guys let me know. Uh, Zeeland put out a, uh, and I, I've started watching him, um, formerly FM, wasn't he FM Base? I think that's what it was, but he goes by Zeeland now, his, his moniker. Um, he put one out about two months ago, and he was talking about the roles compared to the position. And let me know if you guys saw that video and what you thought about it. Uh, some interesting insight. So just something to think about. But anyway, how do we want to go here? Do I want... Yeah, I think I'm going to bring Stokes over there. And then we should have... Well, you know what? No, we're just going to go ahead... We're going to leave Davis over there. Adams has been playing really well. Davis is uh, playing just under a 7. Adams is playing a 7-2. James a 7-5. So they're actually the better partnership in midfield, although Winchester and Adams have the hookup. So that way we're getting our best players on the field. And Mikulski... Yeah, I just don't think he's quite good enough to be starting for us. All right, we're going to go with this. Let's uh, see what happens. All right, pick up where you left off. And get into it. So I, I, I've been kind of leery with this double defensive mid. We seem to get outplayed a little bit in that midfield, but we'll see. All right, Charlie Kirk picks up a slight injury. 
uh, a potential knee injury, a bruised knee. So I think he can fight through that. Oh, who are you? Why didn't you get there, James? Oh, good save by Smith in the goal. Don't like that we were outplayed there. All right, he's back up to 80%. Might have to look at taking him off at the half. That bruised knee could tighten up. All right, we're going to play this one out of the back. McGinley. I was wondering if he was going to try to reverse the field. We play it all the way back to Smith. Hmm. That's an interesting tactic. Nice ball to Winchester. Finds Hall on the outside. Lays it off to Shepard. Squared in. All right, we're controlling the ball. We just can't break them down here. Winchester! What a shot by Winchester. Pun intended. All right, I didn't like that throw. All right, let's uh, let's give a shout here. Um, get creative. First shout of the half. All right, nice ball over to Hall. He's got an overlap coming. Lays it off. Back in. Oh, good touch. Oh, and it goes off the bar. That was unlucky. Unlucky. All right, we're really controlling possession here. All right, I think I'm going to go back to our more attacking posture here. Now, it says he's hampered by his injury. Maybe we go ahead and take him off. Kitching's been playing really well in training. He's actually had some uh, some training sessions over a nine. So we have been uh, really praising him up. Uh, they are, we're not doing badly at all. And no yellow cards. Make the 45 minute change. All right, Davis with the throw in. There's Kitching. Ooh, good first touch of the half for him. Oh, why are we doing that? Oh, good one touch by Kitching. Nice. Oh, there's a good outlet ball. Hall on the run. Cleared out. Ah, oh, Davis. Into Winchester. Back to Davis. Into the box. Shoot! Ugh. Looks like James can't turn on that, uh, can't use a right foot. But he's kicking with a right foot there. It's like he, he turned to really use that left leg for the shot. That's weird. All right, let's give an early creativity shout. Oh, taken down. That's going to be just outside the box. Uh, one of you guys mentioned that uh, I had some bleed over uh, in another video. Uh, I don't know if that's a light up in the corner up here. I narrowed my, uh, my camera shot uh, width uh, to see if that would uh, help that for you guys. And just wide of the mark. Uh, I want to demand more here. Yep, demand more. All right, they're focused. All right, let's make a sub. James. I'm going to bring Adams up for James. Then we're going to bring Davis up for James there. Uh, or we're not. Tell you what, let's let's cancel all that. Not enough people. All right. Well, the easy one is Shepard for Matt Mills. We'll just do that one for right now, and then I'll figure out issues later. All right. We would like. We're controlling the match. 
I don't particularly oh pop it pop it nope there it is and it's in Winchester his third of the season they do like to take some shots from that 25 to 30 yard range but they put him in the net and that is what's important all right real quick tactical change all right, in transition, we're going to have the goalkeeper slow the pace down. I'm going to do that. Let's use a little tighter marking as well. And now let's make a time-wasting sub. All right, Freer, Striker. You know what? Let's put him in for Collins. Collins hasn't scored today. Oh, you know what we could do? Let's bring him on. Let's rest uh let's rest Atchinson. And then we'll slide Collins back. Now he's a right footer. He's a left footer. So let's reverse these guys. No, actually that would be right. As inside inverted forward, inside forwards where they're cutting inside, that would actually be best, right? Right? I think I'm right. All right. See if we can walk away with the points here. Long throw into the box. Keeper makes that save. 88th minute. Two minutes left plus stoppage time. Oh, nice steal. Nice interception there. Collins makes the turn. Cuts it inside. Nice. Lays it off. Adams. Oh, there it is. Oh, they said he was off sides. Was he? Let's watch that again. He's on sides right. Oh, man. I think he was on sides. I think it was uh, this guy right here. I think he was on. I think Collins was off sides. Uh, I think that was a brutal call by the official. But we walk out with a 1 0 win. Dominant performance, I think. Excellent efforts. Good job. All right. Uh, all right. So we get the 1 0 win. One to two days for McGinley. So we're all right there. We pick up 69,000. And Adams, I offered him a rest after my last off camera match. And he was like, I don't need a rest, boss. So, um, we're gonna we're gonna leave him and I will see you guys back here in just a second for the Petersboro match in the leasing.com southern section second round. A lot of S's in there. See you guys back here in just a second. Real quick update. The board is giving me a C plus overall, but they have nothing to criticize. Uh C in transfers and a C in the vision. Um, let's take a look at the vision and see what's going on. All right, well, they're disappointed because we're only in playoffs early in the season and they want us to win promotion. Pleased, we failed in the Carabao Cup. To be fair, we did run into West Brom, so I don't feel horrible there. And A- minus and Bs, I, I think that's a little harsh. I think that's a little harsh. All right, we are having the third round draw for the FA Cup. So let's check that out. Uh, yeah, I don't do this one at a time. We'll just draw everybody. And we draw against uh, championship side Barnsley. So that'll be a tough draw for us. That could be the end of our run, but we'll see. We'll see, but that'll be a third round. And they wanted us to reach reach the second round, right? No, FA Cup, third round. Reach the third round minimum. So they'll be happy with that. All right, let's get on. Evidently a uh, potential takeover rumor uh, that the current uh, board is squashing. We'll see how that goes. We are home underdogs against uh, League One side Petersboro. I'm going to stick with this one. We're going to stay balanced uh, in there. That's our more defensive posture. Tell you what, let's uh, let's add in our U23 squad. 
I've had to finagle around with the roster a little bit with some match congestion, plus the U23s just played. Everybody's kind of tuckered out, so uh, we're we're going to make do with this. Uh, we do have a couple of guys that are a little more tired than I would like, is what it is. So uh, anyway, we're going to go with Bailey up top. We haven't seen him before. Uh, he is a 19-year-old uh, Englishman for us. More of a number 10, but he can play that uh, that number 9. Decent finishing. I think he can do the job today for us. Uh, March, uh, who usually plays up top, is going to move out wide. Collins, uh, who usually plays up top, is going to move out wide. We're going to go with Dawson. He's a uh, He plays a little bit for us. He's more of a reserve guy. Uh, Winchester, Adams, Davis, Kitching, Mills. Mills will get the start. Bernard is uh, one of our younger guys. He's going to be in there and Smith in goal. So let's see how we do. Bernard is lacking match sharpness, which, you know, when you don't play a lot, that does happen. All right, a morale boost. Nobody really took that either way. All right, we want to get creative early. Two early shots, one on target. We are losing the possession battle, so we'll see how that works itself out. All right, they are focused here in the early going. But we are controlling the match. They haven't, you know, they've had the possession, but they haven't really threatened. There's their first shot in the 35th minute, roughly. All right, we need to show some passion. All right, here's a corner highlight. You know, I'm, I'm very nervous. Uh, one of you guys was nice enough to comment that you give up about 80 to 90% of your goals uh, over the course of a season from set pieces. And, uh, you know, that came up because I had mentioned that last episode. I think it was last episode. And, yeah, they're not, uh, they're not really, you know, can't really seem to find a way to overcome that. And he basically said, you know, he's tried all kind of stuff. Uh, let's uh, let's demand more. All right, they're focused. We're right in there. You know what? Uh, oh, crap. I just saw they've got another set piece. All right, so let's go here. Uh, we're going to drop there. I like that better. Hopefully. And a penalty. Yay. That's what I wanted to see. Tony, keeper goes the wrong way, and we are in a 2 nil hole. We're going to have to go up attacking here to try to come from behind, I think. Demand more. All right, they are focused. All right, let's make a sub out here. Adams. Okay, I'm going to bring Davis up, and then Hill can go on the back line. Now, Hill might be, yeah, he's making his debut, 16 years old. He's got pace, and he's at least on the upside of below average on his defensive skills. Certainly can't cross, but he is in a support role. And Winchester, we can bring Grub on for him. All right. And Dawson is injured. Oh. Foot injury, and it's a red that stops the game. So that's bad. Collins, none of those guys. You know what? Collins can play an attacking mid center. So if we slide Grub over, he's just dropping back from a 10 to a, what's that, an 8 or a 7. Um, and we'll bring Best on. Best is 19. Might be a debut for him as well. All right, let's encourage him here. All right, a couple of them are frustrated, but, you know, this is a young squad at this point. We've gone attacking. Nothing's happening. All right, that's going to be a disappointing 2-0 defeat. We were in the game. We were in the game. We just couldn't score. Uh, yes, it was disappointing. 
sure enough, southern sectional, two to three weeks for that injury for Dawson. Best makes his debut, Bailey. And, yeah, you keep telling me that, and he doesn't want to rest. All right, well, let's – and I don't know if I can rest him now with that injury in the midfield. All right, well, that takes us out of two of our – actually, yeah, two of our three uh, competitions. So, really down to focusing on League Two and the FA Cup, which we're probably going to end that run here in the next uh, next match. So, where do we come back here? We've been in pretty good form. You know, we've had you know just a handful of losses in the league and now one in a competition. What if we come back? I tell you what, I really when's the transfer windows in January, is that right? Yes, transfer window opens in January. All right. So let's come back to end the year. We'll come back for Boxing Day against Stevenage. Uh, 29th against Macclesfield. Uh, that's a top, near, you know, near top of the table and near bottom of the table. And then we'll get back in. Uh, I don't know. We want to come right back there for Barnsley in just a few days. Yeah, I'm going to go ahead and finish out the calendar year. And I'll either come back for Exeter or Barnsley. And, you know, those two are Barnsley and Crawley. Probably might be. I'll see where they're sitting when we get to that point. But I'll come back for the higher, higher ranked team. I think that'll be the way to go, because we kind of want to get through the season, but we don't want to skip a ton. But yeah, I'll play these five. We'll come back either he, these two or these two. Uh, we'll get into the transfer window. Uh, I've got to see if we can make some moves uh, to open up some salary, because. Financy, financially, we are right up against it, and we're already losing our butts. So, weird thing is, you can see we're actually breaking even here after one match. It's, I, you know, I don't know how we lost so much money, it, but it just went real fast, poof, uh, like a Vegas ma magic act. All right, guys. Well, if you want to see more and you like what you're seeing, let me know in the comments below. Hit that like button if you're our subscribe button, and the like button. If you like what you're seeing, and if you're new to the channel, subscribe. And we'll see you guys next episode. Take care. Bye.